What's up you guys? We are back to do another Rose Gal try on for the new year. So this one is going to be something kind of like extra fun. There are some pieces that I really wasn't, well it's not some pieces, it's like one, that dress. Uh -huh. There's just one thing that I really didn't care for out of this entire um, haul. But other than that, I do like a lot of the items. What about you? Nay. I liked everything. It was really nice. So we are back. Don't be wiping your nose I on my video. No, don't be yeah. doing that. I just had an itch on my nose. It's not like I'm my, my, my nose. I know. And you guys heard of Rose Gal, Rose Wholesale, Zaful, Gamiz, Sammy Dress, Dress Lily, Twinkle Deals. They are all affiliate sites and they are located in China. Some of the items do come, I've noticed when I do get shipping, it'll come from like, um, what is that really? You are so rude, yawning in the video. They will come from like, some of the things that I've noticed. Goodbye. It should just cut me off. You were asking me and I told you. You was like, Dubai. <sighs> yeah, some of the things do come from Dubai, I noticed, and like Canada with some stuff. So they come from like different places. I guess it all depends on where their warehouses are. So that's why they come in like multiple packages. But I always tell you guys that when you order from them, make sure that you check the time or the shipping processing because some say will ship out within three days. Some say 10 to 5 and some say... Excuse me, some say set 5 to 10 and some say 7 to 15. And they got me all messed up right now. And then some of them do say in stock. So even though like a majority of the items that we ordered was three, um, three days processing, they didn't come in three days. They came like different times. But it was during the holidays, which they were really, really busy. They had like these huge sales. And also make sure that when you measure, I mean, when you order stuff and you're looking at the clothing, make sure that you measure yourself and then you look at each measurement sizing chart for each garment because they all do better so with that being said we're gonna get into this video i'm about to punch her in the back of the head and she do one more off camera thing that's like off camera stuff you do you can't do that on camera they, what are they gonna say about me coughing on camera you should just not do that on camera it's off I camera i have to cough my throat is sore <sighs> anyway you guys so we're gonna get into this I'm so the first thing that i'm gonna show because i really did not like this dress at all it just like uh, I felt like a dominatrix. I felt really like I like to tie people up and just beat them for a living, okay? That's what just beat you. I'm gonna beat her. So when I seen the dress on the web, it looks so it just looks so sexy and different. And I was just like, I'm gonna get it. I don't even know if I'm wearing them wear, but I'm gonna get it anyway. But then as I put it on, I felt like I had no shape, right? It just didn't give me no shape at all. The zipper was awkward. The material made me look just like out of shape. I felt like something from the movie Hellraiser from back in the days. I just really did not like this dress at all. And I think like for the dress, the zipper really should have been like in black and at least on the sides. So it kind of like took away from it. I think it, I'm not really sure if it was supposed to be edgy or not, but yeah, the dress was not for me. It is a size extra large and I like the back part, but you can see like my fat rolls like I, I do have fat rolls and I just really wasn't feeling the dress at all so in my opinion the dress was definitely a miss what I have is a like a space cadet bomber jacket I like it though it is cute I like it it's really nice I'm not sure if it's like a blue or a white that's what I was just sitting here thinking like now it's definitely not white like it's like a blue I think it's really gray because if you look at the collar it looks more grayish grayish silver yeah, this looks yeah. a little gray and fit really nice not too tight on the arms I wouldn't wear a zipper though you never like to wear anything zipper. no because that's just not how do you style it oh so if you're freezing still don't zipper because that's just not style I like guess you want to look cute, like if you're trying to style it nice, but if you just go around and you have a nice outfit and you zip it up, it doesn't look right. So remember that, girls. When you outside and you got a nice jacket on and you know you cute, don't zipper it up. Just freeze your tuchuses off. Don't zip it. Just don't zip her up. Just stay cute and cold. Cute and it. cold. Just skip it. Don't listen to me. <laughs> Okay. Uh, the next dress that I got, I thought it was so like elegant. I don't really know where I'm gonna wear this to, but hey, it would have made a cute thumbnail. When I showed it to Nate, she was like, "Where are you gonna wear that?" I was like, "Well, it's free, and I like, it. and it's super cheap. Like, 
when I say cheap, I don't mean like cheaply made, but it's really inexpensive, especially for it to be like a sequins dress, a mermaid dress. Now you know sequins fabric is expensive as it is, but this dress fits so well. Um, it's a double XL. I love the dress. It's a mermaid dress. Definitely I'd have to wear some heels. I mean, you're supposed to with this, but it fits so tight fitting and if I had like a really nice party to go to, I would definitely wear this dress. It did cinch me at the waist. It just like snatched my waist, which is cool. Now, the top portion is not like anything really expensive. It's just like kind of like, um, I want to say like a t-shirt stretch knit material. It doesn't take away from the dress. If you're wearing this, you're really not going to notice this part too much because it is all black. I like the way it fits. It does have a lining inside of it. For the most part, I like the sequence in it and I love like like the style of it. Um, what I have is a like a a baby pink, like a, a baby pink bodysuit with the zipper in the back. I thought it was really cute. There was a red. I was gonna get red, but then we all sold out of the red, and then we all sold out of the black. And I like I was, that one though. Yeah, I like this one too. It's really nice. It looks. I think it looks good with my complexion and everything. It's really cute. Plus, it has the snaps in the crotch no, area. This is annoying. A velcro. Is it Velcro? No, it's buttons. Let me see. Those are snaps. I don't like that because then it starts digging in my thigh while I'm walking and everything. And the, oh, does it? Yeah, and then I have to adjust the near the crotch area. Don't you ain't got to really like snap it. I'm not just weird. That just feels weird if I like don't snap it. No, I'm saying, but you just have it on. You have it tucked in real good. That's how I would wear it. But I like this one because the rubber right here. Yeah, you have the rubber, and then it won't the. For the off the shoulder um, style, it won't slip up or like on my shoulders or it won't slip down. But. It looks cute. <laughs> <laughs> so the next dress that I have is this pink one. I love this color pink. This is so cute. First of all, it does probably look like it's a wrap dress, but it's really not. It's just a whole entire dress, but it gives the illusion of a wrap dress. And I, let me tell y'all, I don't really like wrap dresses too much because I always feel like they're going to open up and then all my business is going to be exposed. But I do like this one a lot because it's very stretchy and I do like the fact that the tie is really wide so if you're trying to camouflage any type of um, abdomen area then this belt is so wide you can definitely do that um the size that I got is an extra large so to me for this website it kind of runs a little bit bigger than normal um but for the most part I like it I do like the color a lot this, I felt like this gave me like some shape it's a very pretty dress like this is a really really pretty pretty dress um, my next item is that I have um, I guess it explains itself no because sure. it doesn't well, it's just a girl of... Um, I don't know what she's doing. Yeah. I thought she was smoking a cigarette, but... It, it looks like she's smoking a cigarette, but then it doesn't. I don't know. Yeah. You can't see the smoke, but... That don't look like a cigarette. Look like she just got something in her mouth. Who yeah, knows? Well, oh, it's a thermometer! Because she looks sick. Look at her eyes and stuff. I mean... That's what I would think. <laughs> Don't she look sick? Like, like a cigarette, thermometer, a lollipop. It looks like a, but I thought it was really sick. Cute. I thought it was really cute. The color was nice and that the design was really cute. I liked it. Yeah. Okay. What's this? Okay. I was just thinking that just now. What is that? But who knows? Probably extra hair. Just thinking. No. Outside. Never know. So know. then the next item that I do have in this is um. I really like this outfit together. So cute. Um, so the pants, the jeans that are white are the, um, they're just very ultra low cut jeans, white jeans, and they do have like distressed like holes in them, which is so cute. But let me tell y'all, I had to cut them up because if I didn't, they would have been hot water on me. They are a size 3X, but they're the stretch jeans. If they're not, if they were not stretched, then there would have been no way that I were getting into these. But I always go for the jeans that are stretched. I have had the experience of regular jeans in a size 3X, and they had to go to my daughter. So definitely, I would recommend getting stretched jeans that have some stretch to them. I thought that this shirt looked so cute when it when I looked on the website. It reminds me of this dress that I got from them, which is also a blue and white stripe. But they said I look like a southern belle, and I felt like I looked like a southern belle too in it. But I like it because I like that it flows at the waist. It looks like a picnic cloth. This is not a picnic cloth, it's striped. And I look like a southern belle. Uh, my last thing is um, I'm so just hungry. a basic black hoodie with 
just starts at the bottom. The thing that really bothered me was if you can add this, why can't you add pockets? <laughs> There's no pockets. I don't like when my hoodies don't have pockets. And the, the hood is really tight. I can't. It's all the way up on my neck. I have to pull That's it. That's because your head is big. My head's not big. My head is an average sized head. Okay. It's not big. It, it, it could have used some pockets. Yeah, like. there's no pockets. I don't want to stuff my hands in my jeans all day. Because my jeans are already tight. I'm so angry. Me too. Me too. I'm angry for you. Then the next, the last item that you see me wearing is this really cute, um, kind of like, I'm not sure if it's a dress or a shirt. The girl on the video, on um, the video, and the website, I don't remember if she had a, a shirt, a pants on or whatever, but you know, it was supposed to come with this ribbons on the side right here to tighten it, but it didn't. But let me tell you what I'm going to do. That black dress that I said I didn't like, I'm going to take the ribbons off of that and I'm going to put it on this, okay? I'm going to have to cut them, but I'm going to put it on this. What do with the dress? I don't know. I'm not gonna wear it. That's what I know. I'm not gonna do. Um, less is for for Halloween. This is a 2XL. It's really cute. It's comfortable. It's nice fitting, and I think it's super cute. I do like the color a lot. It's like a cranberry cranberryish red, brick red, or whatever burgundy red. It's a very pretty color. It does have like a nice good amount of stretch to it. And then last time I didn't even put it on because I really didn't like how it looked on me. And then I thought it was like a black color on the website. I like the style of it because it reminded me like back in like the early or the late 1800s. You know, um, George Washington today styles and yeah, stuff he like did that. that too he wore a lot of stuff <laughs> <laughs> you like what <laughs> you like broke out with some english accent did he have an english accent i don't know i never i don't know i doubt it he was a yankee i think right well we don't really know but you know oh my stomach was growling i'm hungry I, don't, I wasn't really feeling this too much, but you know, it is what it is. You don't always get stuff that you like. Abraham Lincoln would have loved it. <laughs> well, anyway, I, Abraham Lincoln wouldn't love this. He'd have been like, girl, take their brown, ugly jacket shirt off. I think, why is he saying it like that? I don't know, but he would have said it like that for sure. So, yeah, you guys, we hope you enjoyed this video. Make sure you check out rosegal.com. Also, they always get some coupon codes popping off on their website. The shipping, it all depends on how much you order. It could be free. It could be not free. And they have loads of different payment methods. So, we will leave all the links to each item that we have below. So, on that note, stay diva and delicious. I'm so hungry. We have any tamales left? No. Me and Willow ate them all. Great. I'm the one that asked for them. You guys ate them up. I hate you guys. I love you guys. And my well, mine's were burnt, so who cares? I love you guys. Stay deep and deep delicious. Make sure you rate, comment, subscribe. Thumbs this video up, even though Nate just pissed me off because I'm so hungry. Can you say goodbye? Oh. <laughs> Bye.